Hi, I'm Dustin Hansen with Greywell Entertainment. I'm Zane with Greywell and Salt Pop. This is the Greywell Entertainment update for release day of 4-8-2014. Uh, we're getting close to record store day. Before we get going into all this, I want to tell you a couple things. Come in, look at the record store li day list. Make sure you're getting what you want. You know what locations they'll have, what, what you know, or at least ordered what you may want. Uh, we're going to open at 8 a.m. at all locations. Next week's video will be basically all record store day heavy. So. We'll give you more info there. In the meantime, follow us on facebook.com slash graywell for all the updates and also on Instagram and Twitter at SLC. That way I don't forget to tell you this at the end and we have it all. Speaking of Record Store Day, our friends at Warner Brothers uh, sent us a really cool enter to win kind of contest idea. They're giving away some test presses of this year's limited indie exclusive Record Store Day product. Um, so basically, I'm going to name off, we're going to go through and read off these pieces to you. They're very cool. They are legitimately just a test press, so there's no artwork or anything, but they're the actual album test press versions. Very, very cool of some really great releases from Record Store Day. So what we're going to have you do, if you're interested in any of these as we talk about them here at the beginning of the video, you're going to want to email your name, the band name of the product you want, and test press. So, for example, Flaming Lips, test press with your name emailed to ETW, enter to win, ETW at fatfin.com, our website, F-A-T-F-I-N.com. Is that clear? Yeah. Hopefully that's so clear. So name what you want to ETW at fatfin.com, and uh, we'll show you what we have up for grabs, and then we'll, uh, we'll announce our winners this week. Yeah, we'll hopefully have you come in, pick them up, take some pictures, have some fun with it. All right, so the first one we have to give away is the Mastodon Live at Brixton 2012 2 LP set. Uh, very, very cool test press, very heavy, you know, big double. Still double LP even on test press yeah. and everything. So it's exactly how they were going to be done just without the artwork. The, so Mastodon, Live at Brixton. The second one we have is Flaming Lips Seven Skies H3, which is very cool. <laughs> 35, um, seven Skies High, I guess you can kind of call it too, whatever you want to call it. But we have that one available. Uh, Connor Oberst, Hundreds of Ways, and the B-side Fast Friends on 7-inch. Regina Spector. Um, this one is called You've Got Time with the B-side called Call Them Brothers featuring Only Son, 7-inch. And last but not least, the Jay-Z Linkin Park Collision Course um, vinyl, which was only on CD before, or it was on. CD. I don't know if it was on vinyl before, but for Record Store Day, it's coming out as a uh, transparent blue special edition. So this is the test press of that. So just to be clear, all those just say, write etw at fatfin.com, write your name and the band and test press, and we'll enter to win you for the contest and see if we can get you something cool. And uh, local entrance only, please. We just oh. want people who can come pick this up uh, immediately. I know we have viewers from out of state and stuff. Uh, Maybe you've got a friend that lives in Utah who can come pick it up for you. Yeah. So. Sorry, we don't mean to exclude you, but it's just easier to do it locally with these things. So, yeah. Awesome. All right, well, we're going to start on some releases. There's not a ton to talk about, but I do have a nice little stack of metal and punk stuff to go through with a couple of vinyl pieces as well. Uh, first up, the Gradiators. Um, this is the Doom Stoner Retro Highlight of the Year, according to the sticker. It says, Swedish Retro Rock at its finest. Says a guy from Truck Fighters. So we talked about that new Truck Fighters a little while ago. It was fun, it's really cool. You kind of know what you're getting into with this. This is on Napalm Records. Also on Napalm Records this week um, is D Diabolus in Musica. Um, Argia is the name of the album. Um, so there's that. And uh, Delane, The Human Contradiction, we also have um, out on CD. And there is a deluxe version of this that's available. Uh, a couple stores are getting it, but most of the stores are just gonna have the regular. Also out is a new Black Label Society called Catacombs of the Black Vatican. Um, there's a deluxe edition that has two bonus tracks. All the stores will have that. Remembering Never has a new album called This Hell is Home. Twitching Tongues has a new album called In Love There Is No Law. So. A band called Sheer. album is called Catharsis. Uh, this is a female-fronted thing on Life Force. Um, features guest appearance by... A uh, guy from Stradivarius. So I don't know if it's like very power metally at all, but it could be. 
Um, speaking of female-fronted metal stuff, Annette Olsen has an album called Shine. Um, she was a former Nightwish singer. I think Nightwish has gone through like three or four people as singers. Um, she was one of them. This is her solo album, so uh, I don't know how much it has in common with metal, but um, if you like the female-fronted stuff, you might dig that. And then uh, for the Fallen Dreams, Heavy Hearts, um, out on Rise Records. So you know what to expect there. And then uh, a couple vinyl pieces. First up is The Sword. Um, this is The Hidden Masters slash Arcane Montaigne. This is a uh, double seven inch single. Uh, it's new material from new album, right? Yep. So um, features cool artwork. This artwork on the front is actually by Becky Cloonan, who's a really famous uh, comic book uh, and illustrator. Uh, she's really cool, so picked that up for that. And then Off has a new album. This is uh, Keith Morris, Black Flag singer. Um, his, his punk band, the punk band that he's in now. Very good punk rock, very fast, very aggressive. A little even more fast and aggressive than last. Yeah, off record. Definitely so, heavier than last time. Um, same great artwork and everything. So pick that up. Raymond Pettibon. Yep. All right, I have a handful of records to go through, and then a bunch of CDs and movies. So we're gonna start with uh, Ave Terre's um, Slasher Flicks. Enter the Slasher House on vinyl. We have this on CD as well. Uh, this is through Domino. He's from uh, Animal Collective. Yeah, very so. odd release. Very interesting sounds. A lot of mixes of kind of everything. So. Which if you're a fan of Animal Collective, you already kind of know yeah, true. <laughs> what yeah. that's like. Um, a new release on Burger Records, Denny and the Jets, uh, called Mexican Coke. Actually a very great record, very fun. Um, new Sweet Apple record, Jay Mascus was in this band. Uh, it's kind of a, I don't know, more of a stoner riff version of Dinosaur Jr. A little bit of a super group yeah, type thing. Yeah, absolutely. It's, it's Jay Mascus, Tim Parnon, uh, John Pelkovich, and David Sweet Apple. Very, very cool. Kind of power pop, if you want to call it that. So, very cool. Um, a band called Rat King from the Bronx. So it goes. Featuring King Cruel on one of the tracks and Wavy Spice on another. And then two very cool soundtracks. We finally got in the soundtrack to Jim Jarmusch's new movie, Only Lovers Left Alive, the new vampire movie. It features um, Joseph Von Wiseman and Squirrel doing a lot of music uh, on vinyl and CD. Very, very cool. And we got in the Mondo release of Jerry Goldsmith's classic soundtrack to The Omen. The artwork on it alone is worth buying it for. It's super cool. So these are both in stock at all locations. This did not come on CD. This is a vinyl only release, so. All right, and I'll go fast through these. We have EMA, Emma, which is um, Erica M. Anderson. This is her second album uh, on Matador called The Future's Void. Uh, Proto Martyr, un Undercolor of Official Right. Yep. It's um, hardly art. Hardly art. Kronos Quartet has a new album called Thousand Thought, A Thousand Thoughts, uh, featuring a lot of really interesting people and in traditional music. Very, very cool. Uh, the Color Music has a new album called May You Marry Rich. The Groovy Ghoulies are back with a new album called Flying Saucer Rock and Roll, the first three seven inches. So technically it's not new, it's just a collection. Avicii, True Avicii by Avicii, it's the, uh, all his songs remixed by himself. So he's just remixing himself, kind of uh, just an excuse to recent re release another record. So there you go. Uh, Chunky, Chuck English, the mastermind behind the cool kids has a new album called Convertibles. Um, we had a single for that, I think, or something, but now it's out officially. Patton Oswalt's new comedy record comes with the DVD. It's called Tragedy Plus Comedy Equals Time. Uh, very funny stuff. 65 Days of Static, Fall of Math, the Luxury reissue, has an entire disc too, which features the whole EP and the Retreat Retreat B-sides. Faint Doom Abuse uh, is out on CD now. We talked about the exclusive vinyl we had last week, but are now the CD's coming. Linda Ronstadt Duets, featuring Aaron Neville, James Ingram, Bette Midler, Frank Sinatra, Emmylou Harris, and Dolly Parton, a whole bunch of different duets from, Amy, or from Linda Ronstadt. Carlene Carter, um, Country featuring Willie Nelson, Vince Gill, Chris Christopherson, uh, also June Carter and Johnny Cash. Um, this is their daughter. So uh, also has Elizabeth Cook on the record, who's one of my favorite, you know, new country singers. So very cool. And last but not least, James Durbin celebrate on Wind Up Records. So that's the music we have for you. Then we talk about some movies real quick. Um, Paz de la Huerta plays Huerta is her name. <laughs> um, this, out, this movie's called Nurse in 3D. It comes in regular Nurse. Apparently this is a, just a really weird, scary 
overly sexual, weird movie. So horror thing. Yeah, interesting. Uh, Paranormal Activity, the marked ones on DVD and Blu-ray. August Osage County. Uh, it's a play, but it's been made into a movie. Feed with Julia Roberts and Chris Cooper and Neil McGregor and every, just about anyone you can think of is in this movie. Oh, so. Meryl Streep. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, her. <laughs> she wins awards and stuff. Uh, Cocaine Cowboys Reloaded. Uh, it's a the untold stories. It's the same movie, but with 60 minutes of new material put uh, cut into it. So very, very interesting. If you haven't seen this before, this is a great thing to watch. Uh, Robert De Niro and Robert. Or, uh, Robert De Niro and Sylvester Stallone beating each other up in a movie called uh, Grudge Match. And ever, uh, Kevin Hart's in it too, so there you go. Um, Hobbit, Desolation of Smog on DVD, Blu-ray, and Blu-ray 3D with all the Blu-ray, DVD, everything in it, digital copies. So you can find watch the second movie of a trilogy that no one wanted. So. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. Better know. than the first. So. And last but not least, there's a movie on Draft House Films that I highly recommend to anyone that likes weirdo cinema. Uh, if you're into like El Topo or any of the Jodorowsky stuff, this is a visually very cool, messed up storyline movie um, based in England in 1648 AD. It's about some uh, deserters fleeing from a battle, and they end up getting caught up in this little adventure i guess you can call it it's a total mind warp it's Drug such trip. a such a cool movie it involves mushrooms and the devil and some very 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 cool stuff um written uh written by amy jump and directed by ben wheatley on draft house highly highly recommend this for weirdo cinema so that's everything uh appreciate it and uh don't forget to enter to win for those test presses um and follow us on all the stuff i talked about and we'll have a longer record story video coming up for you real quick thanks a lot